Okay, see you later. Oh, Emma, your wages. All right. <laughs> All right, see you. Bye. Megan, I need that Steve Rodolfo file, pronto. Megan! Unbelievable. Oh, what time did you call this? Sorry, Ryan, I missed the bus. Slack. It's not a good start to the week, Emma. I need you in your uniform, cleaning those toilets ASAP. They're still blocked, you know. Alright, keep your earpiece Is it? Thirty what a day. Well. Any luck with the job hunting? Hey, I've been looking all day. Hopefully you have something soon, eh? God, I hope you do. I'm not sure how long I can keep two jobs up for. Hey, I've made you some pasta. Here we go. Emma? Em? What's wrong? Um, it's Sarah. You're not going in.
sorry, I'm not. So when's your flight? Oh, Emma, you are going. Oh, Emma, you've got to go. What is it to think about? A flight. The cost. The fact we haven't spoken for five years. The flight, well, first of all, the flight's nothing. Nothing? You're going to have to face this fear, Emma. This isn't a holiday to Spain. This is a trip to say goodbye to Sarah. Forever. Ah, oh, Dave. Would you kindly put the kettle on, Helen? Great to see you, Dave. You too. Uh, I've not had any luck with the Spanish album, but uh, I am in touch with the man in London. Okay. Now. That is the finest example I've ever seen. Perfectly smooth. Mm -hmm. Not a blemish. Mm -hmm. it, it's original, right? Hundred and fifty, did you say? Yes. I'll give you the money. No. You can pay me back. No. You're so bloody stubborn. Look, here's the guy that helped me with my smoking. Hypnotherapy? It's an option. But you still smoke. I've got down on my drinking, though. card in there that Jack got me. Mm. Ah. How much? It's only a quid. You don't mind, do you? I suppose not. Listen, Dave. I've decided I'm going to go to Australia. Really? What about the money? I'll just sell whatever I can. My car. <laughs> that wreck? Doesn't even run. Oh, it's got to be worth something. And have you forgiven her? I need to know why. And how are you even going to get on the plane? You can't even get in a lift. I've got to try. Claire suggested hypno. <sighs> Waste of money. I need your support, Dave. Hello, babies. What are you doing? Selling anything I don't need. Emma, can I see my office, please? <sighs> Emma. 
I'm so sorry about yesterday. Hey. Phone call would have been nice. It's just that... I'm not so... concerned with your excuses. Your lateness is becoming a constant issue. What are you saying? We're a professional outfit here, Emma. And we pride ourselves on running like clockwork. I had to clean your toilets yesterday. Me. So with regret, I'm gonna have to let you go. What? I'm sorry, Emma. I wish you well. <clears throat> My sister has cancer. That's why I was off, okay? I need this job. I can't afford not to work. So, I'm going to go and clean, like I'm paid to. Okay. There's some money missing from here. Is it not in one of your other hiding places? No, it was in here. No, I just don't use a bank like everybody else. I got some food in last week. I could have borrowed a bit from there, maybe. Dave, this isn't your money just to take. And I don't want to use a bank. We have a budget for food. We had no food in. Well, then get a job. Do my papers till you get sorted. <laughs> Sorry, Emma. I'm not 13. It's money, Dave. You're bringing nothing into this house. I can't afford to keep you. I'm struggling enough as it is to raise cash without you taking from me. And stop spending what little we've got on those stupid football cards. Look, Ems, I'm sorry about the money. You're right. I should have asked you first. There's a guy coming to look at the polo soon. Will you speak to him for me? You know me, I know nothing about cars. I need to get as much as I can for it. For the flights. Definitely going. Yeah, I'll give you uh, four hundred for it. Sounds fair. Four hundred. Four. It was down for eight hundred. What happened? I tried. The cam belt snapped, Emma. What do you expect? Hello? Yeah, uh, just hold on. I mean, you said weeks. Maybe longer. Oh. Hi. Are you here to join our party? It's Claire in. 
Mm. Emma! You get upstairs. Put that on. Okay. I need to talk to you. Yeah, come on. I'm sorry about Alistair. It's the cancer. It's progressing rapidly. She's only got a few days left. Oh, shit. I need to go in a day or two. What do you need? A night's work. I'll give you the money. I I'll work for it, Claire. I don't want handouts. Just nothing illegal. Emma. What is it you think that I do? Anybody want a strawberry? 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 Alexander, you want a strawberry? No, thanks. Sure. Jack? Guess what I'm looking at. Brian, my sister, her condition's getting worse. I'm gonna have to go in the next day or two. Is there any way you can advance my wages? I need to pay for the flight. You can't really do that. But you're the boss. Please. See me after your shift. There's your money. How did it go? Really strange. Funny, actually. I'm sorry for thinking you... I always thought. I know what you thought. Is 400 enough? Yeah. I got an advance on my wages, so with this and some savings, it takes me to about 1500. I'm gonna buy my flights tomorrow. 
Thanks, Claire. Mm. I'm thinking of going via Dubai. Seems like the shortest route. What's that? No ages. How come you've got them now? I got an advance. That much? Yeah. Look, Emma, are you sure you're doing the right thing? I don't think you should be going. What? Not after what you said she did to you. Dave. I really don't. And there's the money thing. We, we can't afford this. We can't. But I can. This is my money. I've slaved and grafted for this. What, what about me? What about you? Well, money-wise. Have you had any response back from those job applications? None of them have got back to me. There's no jobs anywhere. I don't seem to have a problem finding work. What? Delivering newspapers and sticking your hands down toilets? You either find a job or you'll have to find somewhere else to live. She's my sister. I'm going. Of course I want it. It's just it's going to take me some time to raise the... Well, what's the rush? I'm one of your oldest customers. Surely you can keep hold of it for me. But Jack... Oh, OK, never mind. Wait. Electric, eh? You, uh, <clears throat> You do know those are strictly forbidden in here. But, uh, I won't tell the boss if you don't. What's happened? It's all gone. Every penny, it's all gone. Thanks very much for the cup of tea, Mrs. Travis. Miss Whipple. I can't believe we're not in 
show it. So, how's business? Oh, you know me, Jack? Yeah. You? Well, actually, I've just sold a very rare album. Football again? I got £1,500, so I'll be wanting to uh, book some more sessions. <clears throat> oh, well, I, I must dash. I think you've forgotten something. Oh. Mustn't leave that behind. Thought you were going away, Emma. Emma? Come on. When I was eight, I was put into care. I didn't have anyone in the world. I didn't know what was going on or what I'd done wrong. I had to teach myself to be brave. Things happened to me that I've never spoken about, not to anyone. It was tough, really tough. But you're the toughest person I know, Emma. There's not one scintilla of doubt that you're a proud person. But let me book the flight. It's my gift. Everything I've got, which isn't a lot, I've worked for. And any time I need to go anywhere, I pay for it with my own money. I'm your friend, Emma. This isn't charity. What about Sarah? It's just the way I am. <sighs> Dave stole your money. He's not a thief. I'm sorry, Emma, but he is. Why are you saying that? Claire? Dave Travis bought an album off you yesterday. He stole the money off me to buy it. Yes. So I've been advised. <laughs> what can I do for you? Once I find the album, I want you to buy it back. Today. Do we have a deal? OK. Let me know when you want your first freebie.
that's the one. Still not picking up. How could I be so stupid, Claire? Why didn't I see who he really was? It's not your fault, Emma. We can't always see people for who they really are. Yeah, maybe that's my problem. Maybe I don't see people for who they really are. So it's too late. To relax. Okay. Well, hurry up, we're going to miss your flight. You didn't tell me about Dave buying the album straight away. You didn't tell me because you wanted to protect me. Thank you. I don't need protecting anymore. Will you do me a favour? Where's Emma? Hmm. Right now, I imagine she's somewhere over France. And this? Is this how she paid for it? Oh, maybe the thief came back, Dave. <sighs> you bitch. I think it's time you were going. <laughs> what? You've sponged off my best friend for two years. You're leaving. Tonight. <laughs> to see you make me. <clears throat> Thanks for that, guys. Something for the playroom, perhaps?
Must be Emma. She needs a rest. I can stay in here for a bit. Emma, she hasn't been able to rest since she knew you were coming. Nurse. Uh, Joe. Joe. How does she look? She looks beautiful. Sarah when I was ten. She still has it. We haven't spoken for so long. 25th of July, 2008. All these years I blamed her. All she ever wanted was to protect me. I've misread so many people. How can she ever forgive me? sister's room. Call if you need me. <laughs> 